Hallelujah. Glory to God. Shalom, people of God. I welcome you all to another prophetic session of the word and declaration of sweet lineage. If this is your first time seeing me or coming across my channel, thank you so much for stopping by. God bless you. I pray the Lord use this channel as a medium for your spiritual growth. I pray as you continue listening to these prophetic messages, may God use one of these messages to transform your life in the name of Jesus. Please kindly like, share, and subscribe so you'll become part of this amazing family. As for those returning as family, thank you so much. I love you all so much and I will keep interceding for you. Do not forget to always send your prayer requests. Do not forget to email me each time you're troubled and you need direction on a particular problem. Please, I'm here for you and I will pray and intercede for God to bring that miracle to pass in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, we thank you, Lord. We glorify your name. King of kings, Lord of lords, we worship you for there is no one like you. Abba, Father, we thank you for your grace that is at work in our lives. Father, we thank you for your faithfulness. Lord, we thank you for providing for us each day. Father, we say we are grateful. Lord, I pray for everyone that is connected to this prophetic word today. Lord, may you grant them their heart desires in the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. The Lord says, they left you in the middle of nowhere. This person I'm talking to, you were abandoned by someone you love and trust. This is someone you could vouch for. This is someone you thought loved you genuinely, but this person abandoned you. This person left you. They left you because they felt like you were good for nothing. They left you because they felt like no one could come for you. But God showed up for you. God has picked you up and you're moving on. God is blessing you. Right now, they are looking at you with so much pain and regret. They are looking at you and they felt like you are never going to be anything. They felt like you will be in the same position when they kept you forever. But God has changed the situation for you. The Bible says, one with God is majority. If God is with you, who then can be against you? I pray for you. May God continue to bless you. May God continue to increase you. May God bless the works of your hands. I pray for you that may God give you the ability to forgive the people who have hurt you in time past. May God give you the ability to, to forgive your mockers in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you all so much for being a part of this session. I hope you receive this word with gladness. Please do not forget to turn on your notification bell so whenever I upload new content, you will be the first to know. I love you all so much, family. I'll see you in our next session. God bless you. Shalom.